hello everyone welcome back to the channel in today's video is not going to be about programming and i apologize for that it's about how to configure KNC wi-fi on ios and android so with that said let's jump right in so on the browser or phone just type in KNC wi-fi configuration oh there it is so as you can see it's one of the most frequently asked questions and especially on iphone so let's click on the link below. So you can see here that as a matter of fact, it's always fun and relief to get Wi-Fi internet access on campus without having to buy data bundle from your chop money or Momo wallet. And these Wi-Fi routers are located throughout the university residence halls and lecture theaters in order to reduce students faculty members and also internet connectivity cost so let's proceed to configure our wi-fi let's first of all start with the ios so you can see there is a link click here to download the configuration file you can click on that link to download the configuration file i also put the link down in the description below so you can check it out so this is how the configuration file looks like so all you need to do here at this point is to click on the download button so you need to click on the download anyway and also try to allow the website to download the configuration profile for you so click on the allow button so you can see in here that our profile is downloaded and we need to review this profile in our settings and install it so let's do that let's move on to our settings so within the settings we go to the general and also within the general click on the profile so in here i'm having two profiles and this is because i've already done one i've already configured one and for tutorial's sake i have the additional one so so up there you should click on install and i'm not going to do that this is because i already have one configured so when you click on install it will lead you to a different page and you should also click on install again so with that you are done with the wi-fi configuration so try to access the wi-fi and pass in your username and the password that's pretty much it so let's try with the android so on the android you need not to download any configuration file or you need to go to the settings on the android device and select wi-fi connection so step two you click on kns wi-fi to configure your device for use proceed to step three select the advanced option and you should choose option to configure such as eap method so under the eap method you choose ttls and under phase 2 authentication you choose pap every other settings should stay the same so step 5 all you need to do is to enter your username and password in the space provided and identity and password respectively enter your name in the anonymous identity field and all you need to do is to ensure your credentials are properly entered and click on the connect button so with that you are good to go if you find this video to be useful smash that thumbs up button and also subscribe to always stay updated share for the video to reach many those who find difficulty in connecting see you in the next tutorial until then stay tuned